Hey guys, today we're going to finish out your eight note cards. So you should have four more note cards. So that's what we're doing today and a pencil. So remember on each card, you're going to prep with your instrument. You're either clarinet, horn, or trumpet. So pick one, the one you play, and put it up here. And then your first and last name. All four cards need this. And all four cards need the five lines of the staff and your treble clef. So push pause if you need to do that on all four. But we're gonna keep going. Your first note that we're drawing for spaces is going to be the first space F. You're gonna circle it with a whole note. And we're going to write F on the back of that first card. And we're gonna move on to card number two. So card two. And this is where it's a little different because we're no longer in the staff. You're going to be below the staff. Now, it's kind of like it's hanging off the staff or that first space below. So the note that hangs off of the staff is the letter D because we're going backwards from E, that bottom line, to D. So D is hanging off the bottom of the staff. For the next card, you're going to draw a ledger line. Now, you've already drawn the notes that go on the ledger lines, but we've already done that. So, the D would be here. If you're going backwards in the alphabet, D, C, and the note before C is B. So the B is going to hang off of that ledger line, right underneath, and on the back of your card three, you're going to write P. And then I'm going to erase this. Keep that ledger line though. Uh, for your for your last card. So we're going to card four. So you need two ledger lines for card four. We just had letter C and we had letter B because that was from the last group. So B and then before B is A and then we have to go backwards. But what's before A in the musical alphabet? Well, it should be G because we just restart. So we're going to let a whole note hang off of that. And that bottom note is a G. So now you should have eight cards total to be practicing and be ready to get tested on.